There are about 1,200 acres of willow that are part of this USDA project areas in Jefferson, Oneida, and Lewis counties. All of this material that's being planted here as well as in the other areas uh, will be harvested and ultimately sent to ReEnergy Holdings. And ReEnergy has two wood to energy uh, power plants here in the area and they'll be taking that willow and mixing it with other wood harvested from the forest to make renewable energy. So the process we're focusing on today is actually getting this material on the ground. What we use is one year old stems of willow. The planter that's running takes these one year old stems and cuts them into sections uh, and then plants them into the ground. So a seven or eight inch section of stem is cut off and pushed down into the ground by this planter. Following planting, pre-emergent herbicide is applied uh, in order to help with the weed control and weed management. And then we'll monitor this and watch this grow for a period of three to four years before the first harvest occurs. So some of the benefits associated with the USDA uh, biomass crop assistance project here in this area are the opportunity to make use of marginal farmland. So a farmland that's not prime in terms of growing other agricultural crops uh, will support a good crop of willow. It'll also give an opportunity to create jobs here in the rural economy. So growing this material in the rural economy, harvesting it and then using it in a power plant that's right here in the region keeps the energy jobs uh, local and gives them new job opportunities for people in the region.